Hi, I'm Katie Mansfield. I teach our high schoolers on Monday nights, and I am here to welcome you to New Hope this Sunday morning. Thank you so much for being here with us. We're so glad to have you. If you're a visitor with us or just somebody who has never filled out an information card before, go ahead and pick one of those up, fill it out, drop it in the offering bin, or take it out to the welcome booth at the front of the church. We'd love to connect with you outside of this Sunday service and uh, give you some more information about what we do here at New Hope, what times our services are, and what we offer our kids. Thanks again for being with us. Merry Christmas, everybody. Let me tell you about some of the special service times we have scheduled for the coming weeks. Christmas Sunday is going to be December the 22nd. That is when our Christmas choir will be sharing the message of Christmas through music, and we will have our special Christmas message. Our service times on that Christmas Sunday are a little bit tweaked. 7.45 is our early service, not 8 o'clock. 7.45, 9.15, and 11 a.m. So we would love to have you at any one of those three services and let's enjoy a very special Christmas time together. We also have a Christmas Eve service this year. We're only going to have one. It will be at 4 p.m. on Christmas Eve. This will be the first time in 26 years we haven't done a 9 p.m. service, but we are gonna have a very special time at four o'clock. So we'd love to have you come and join us. Christmas Eve service, 4 p.m. Merry Christmas. Have a wonderful time with your family, with your faith, and with your friends. I'm Emily. My name's Terry. I'm Candace. I'm Debbie. I'm Joe. And this is God's story. This is God's story. This is in God's my life. story in my life. In my life. In my life. Emotional eating is one. Uncontrollable anger. Divorce, codependency, and control. People pleasing. Alcoholism, drug abuse. Relationships. Suicidal depression. An addiction to the streets and that life. Performance-based. Destruction. Scared. A mess. Desperate. A sense of hopelessness and helplessness. Having to do it right. Broken. Darkness. Confused. Spiritually dead. Lost. Pain. Surprised at the word recovery. Confused often. Some people are afraid. Addictions. Rehab from addictions. Churchy things. Getting real with hurts, habits, and hangups. It's a place where I found true healing in our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Peace. Deliverance. God really helping us to become who He wants us to be. I'm more open, more accepting. I don't isolate anymore, and um, it's beautiful. It's grown me um, as a man, as a husband, as a father, so it's affected all the relationships that I have. I don't believe I would be walking here anymore without my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. I can't live without Him. I can't breathe without Him. I didn't really understand what surrender meant and how to really surrender your life to God and and live for Christ. This is the closest I've ever been to God. Um, when I accepted His grace and mercy, I just fell in love and I had a peace and joy that I've never had before. I thought it was a gift other people had and um, it was there waiting for me the whole time. So it's for everybody. Celebrate Recovery is not only for people that have identified addictions, it's for all of us uh, that have hurts, habits, and hangups. Oh, it'll change your life. Celebrate recovery. Celebrate recovery. Celebrate recovery. Celebrate recovery. Celebrate recovery. Try it, you might just like it. <laughs>